football. You can't beat this football. Kirk Cousins and the Redskins at six and seven. Same record as the Eagles and the Giants. Redskins control their own destiny. The Bills have won the toss, selected to defer. Rashad Ross back deep as Jordan Gay gets things started here at Landover. Take it at the three by Ross. Stumbles, and he is down as he crosses the 15-yard line. So Kirk Cousins will lead the Redskins offense out onto the field. He's thrown a touchdown pass in every game this season. How about his numbers at home? 12 touchdowns, only two interceptions. On second and eight, catch is made by Reed, who had a tremendous game last week. He stepped out of bounds a yard shy of a first down. Second down at 11. Cousins with time. And the catch is made by Deshaun Jackson in Bills territory. A Redskins first down again of 28. Well, this is where the progression of Kirk Cousins is most evident, in my opinion. The confidence in stretching the field. Watch the little double move on the outside with Deshaun Jackson against Ronald Darby. Little stutter go, releases by. That's a heck of a throw by Kirk Cousins. You've got safety help moving over that squeezes it. This ball has to be put in a certain spot, and Kirk Cousins drops it right in. From the Bills, 47, play action. It's the fullback, Young, who makes the catch. Takes it to the Bills, 41 for a gain of six before he was tackled. Cousins has started the game three for three. Off the play fake, he's now four for four. It's Ryan Grant who picks up another Washington first down. Tackle made by Darby, gain of 13. Well, we saw this last week in Chicago, a very impressive opening drive for the Redskins against the Bears. They're doing it again this week. Sean McVay getting Kirk Cousins into a great rhythm on this opening drive. And they are on the move again as Cousins hands it off. Morris brings a tackle inside the 20 to the 19-yard line for a gain of nine. Watch Alfred Morris on this. Should be stopped right here, right? Watch him continue to work, stutter. That's a heck of a run right there. That's getting big positive yards when there was really nothing there to gain. Second down and one as Reed shifts to the left side. Off the fake to Morris. Catch is made by Jordan Reed. He's inside the five and finally down at the three. 16 yards on the catch and run. This is just scouting. You have to know that this is coming. Okay, you may be wanting to rush the passer, but when Jordan Reed leaves and goes to the other side, as you come upfield right there, take a shot at him. Bump him off of his route. You're not, a, that's the most important thing at that play at that time. Cousins remains perfect. Two receptions for Reed. First and goal from the three. Cousins throws it his way. Reed makes the catch for a Redskins touchdown. Well, they told us they were going to treat Jordan Reed as a wide receiver. That was one-on-one -on -one with a safety and coverage. So one-on-one -on -one coverage on the outside, Jordan Reed versus a safety. I'm going to take that every single snap. Buffalo needs to make an adjustment. They talked about treating him in a specific way to get better matchups. And in that critical situation right there, they went standard matchup against the tight end. And Jordan Reed's going to win that. Reed with his eighth touchdown of the season, seventh in the last eight games. Here is Dustin Hopkins, who was a Bills draft pick back in 2013. Hopkins adds the extra point. Redskins capitalize on their opening possession. They drive 84 yards and lead 7-0. Buffalo Bills offense out on the field for the first time. Tyrod Taylor with the fifth highest passer rating in the NFL this season. Out of the shotgun. On first down and a big hole for LaShawn McCoy. Taylor looked right, now moving to his left. Can't find anyone downfield and a good second effort. Took a hit along the sidelines and he is close to a first down. They must get to the Redskins 47 and they do as the catch is made by Woods for a Buffalo first down. Eight of 15. Taylor again moving left, directing traffic. And Taylor will cross the 40 down to the 37 yard line. Watkins, top of your screen, split wide to the right. 
Taylor under pressure, moving right. Now he throws. Too far for Watkins. From the 29 on first down, Cousins to the outside to Deshaun Jackson, who makes the catch at the 36 for a gain of seven. Third down and one. Cousins over the top, it's Reed. Bounces off the tackle, and this is Matt Jones in the backfield. His first carry, and the rookie out of Florida is close to another Redskin first down. My God! Wide receiver screen, it's Jackson on first down. And Jackson takes it down the sidelines to the 39-yard line for a gain of seven as the clock winds down. And this should take us to the end of the first quarter. Cousins under pressure, forced to throw it into the ground. He saw Jerry Hughes coming. Jones in the backfield with Darrell Young. Movement prior to the snap. Encroachment. Defense. Number 96. Five-yard penalty. First down. Jackson in motion. From the 32. Cousins fires, and it's Jackson who makes the catch. Makes it all the way down to the Bills. Five-yard line. A 27-yard completion. Good aggressive play call on first down. There's number 11, Deshaun Jackson. Again, it's just that little wiggle rod, that little lean to the outside, and then up the field vertically. Fourth catch of the game for Jackson for 70 yards. From the five. And Jones is met in the backfield and taken down by Manny Lawson. My God. On second and goal, high snap. And the pass could not be handled by Jones with Hughes defending. Now third and goal, another high snap. Cousins moving to his right. He's inside the 10 to the 5, still going. Touchdown! 13-yard scoring run, Kirk Cousins. I don't think this was a called run from the get-go, but the, the players adjusted immediately once Kirk Cousins got to the outside. I think it's designed to get here. Uh, maybe it is design. They've got they got pullers out in front. What a what a gutsy call by the Redskins in a third and long situation called quarterback run. Hopkins, the extra point, 14 nothing, Washington. Her cousins into the end zone. Third down and five. Taylor looks to step up. Jason Hatcher brings him down back at the 12. Two straight Redskin sacks of Tyron Taylor. Tyron Taylor, nowhere to go with the ball. Look at the front four. If you can get this much pressure with your down four, that means you're dropping seven into coverage. And they covered the Bills' wideouts like a blanket. Well, the Redskins go to work from their 44-yard line. Cousins with time. There is a flag as the catch is made by Reed. And Jordan Reed takes it all the way to the Buffalo 31, a 25-yard completion. And we'll check with the referee, Cleve Blakeman. Prior to the pass, holding defense for 21. Hey! My God! Redskins must get to the 22. As Cousins throws and making the catch for a Washington first down is Garcon. Pierre Garçon working against Bakari Rambo. Redskins in the red zone at the Buffalo 18-yard line. Cousins fires, Reed, touchdown, his second today. Wow. Washington is just doing anything that they want offensively coming from the inside again Jordan Reed we talked about his matchup issue presses to the outside nice break back to the inside Leotis McKelvin's playing heavy on the outside inside help doesn't get there Dustin Hopkins 
His third extra point. Second touchdown for Jordan Reed. 21 nothing Washington. This is a huge play for the Bills right now. This game is on the cusp of getting away from them. They cannot go three and out in this series right here. They must get to the 19-yard line for a first down. Taylor on third and ten. Down he goes. Ball comes loose on the sack by Kerrigan. It's recovered by Cordy Glenn, the left tackle. That is the third Redskin sack of Tyron Taylor today. Now Schmidt from deep in his end zone. Crowder on the run, takes it, and then loses the football. Tried to field it at the 37, and the Bills have recovered. Jamison Crowder can't secure it, and now the Bills with a first down outside the 40-yard line. From the 42-yard line. This is Taylor off the fake to McCoy, crosses midfield, and picks up a Buffalo first down. Taylor to the Redskins, 45. Third down and six. Taylor on the slant. The antenna receiver, Hogan, with Will Compton on the coverage. Rex Ryan leaves his offense on the field, fourth down and six. Taylor out of the shotgun, three receivers set. And it is Sammy Watkins who makes the catch for a Buffalo first down. Needed six and gained eight. From the Redskins, 32. Off the play fake. Taylor steps up and takes off. Taylor is all the way to the 21-yard line as he picks up another Bills first down, a gain of 11. Off the fake to McCoy. Taylor again under pressure from Kerrigan. And it's Kerrigan who makes the tackle. Marked down just inside the 13. It will be third at about a yard and a half. DJ Manuel has come in. Taylor split wide to the right. Two quarterbacks on the field for Buffalo. And this is Manuel. And he will pick up the first down and then loses the football. But it looks like he was ruled down. Recovered in the end zone by Will Blackman, but they will bring it back out. First and goal from the Redskins, six. And this is Taylor. And he's tackled by Will Compton, down at the one. Taylor hands it off to McCoy. Looks like he's down right there. He's down short. He's going to skid in beyond that line, but he was down before it. Third and goal, it is McCoy, and he is stopped. You mentioned pot roast, Terrence Knight. He makes the tackle. He makes the tackle, but Kendrick Golson has been a beast in this goal line situation. Fourth and goal. They take out the big personnel, send in three wide receivers. Taylor out of the shotgun. On fourth down, Taylor to the end zone. He was looking for Watkins. Breland on the coverage. No flags. Uh, they tried the middle of the field a couple times in the run game. I expected him to hit the edges at least once in the run game. Great goal line stand by the Redskins defense. Bills cannot capitalize. Redskins looking to maintain first place and control of their own destiny in the NFC East. Bills will be eliminated with a loss today. First half numbers, rushing yards even, but how about the disparity in the passing yards? Well, disparity in the passing yards, first downs. You know, Washington has just controlled the entire first half. First and ten from the 31-yard line. Taylor, about 5 to one downfield, spins away. And that is tackled by Will Blackman as he gets back to the line of scrimmage. On second and ten, first carry today for Gillisley. And he takes it out close to a first down. Here's Taylor with loads of time. Now he throws, and it's Sammy Watkins who picks up a Buffalo first down in Redskins territory. Sammy Watkins is going to work from the left side. He goes all the way across the field. 
into that empty area right there. That's that's too long of a play to develop. First and ten from the Washington 31. Poncho in as an extra blocker. This is Carlos Williams, his first carry today. And Williams will be wrapped up and thrown out of bounds by Angelo Hall after gaining 11 and a Bills first down. From the 20 on first down, it's Williams again. And he runs into the arms of Deshaun Golson, gain of seven, second down and three. Ballard looking. Now he throws to the end zone. That's play of the drive for Buffalo. On the read option, he faked the handoff to Gillisley, and then it's Knighton who makes the tackle. Well, here's Dan Carpenter out to attempt a 32-yard field goal. Colton Schmidt will place it down from the left hash. Carpenter's kick is straight through. So the Bills are on the board. Redskins defense holding the Bills to three and not seven. Cousins and the Redskins go back to work as Cousins fires downfield. What an adjustment by Deshaun Jackson. And he will take it all the way. 77 yards for the Redskins touchdown. Last week against Chicago, the end of the game, Kirk Cousins threw one up to Jordan Reed and referred to it as an opportunity ball. And I need to get comfortable with my guys on the outside so that I can do that more often. That's what this is. This is an opportunity ball for Deshaun Jackson. Coverage is not bad by Corey Graham. I'm going to underthrow it, little back shoulder. There's another step, another step in the process for Kirk Cousins, building off of something from the previous week with a 77-yard touchdown as the Redskins look to maintain their hold on first place. Yeah, very important to this offense, and we wondered how healthy he was. He had that knee bruise last week. He looks fine this afternoon. Third touchdown pass of the day for Kirk Cousins. First and 10 for the Bills from their 20-yard line as Taylor will take off. Out to the 29-yard line. Second down and one. Out of the backfield, it's Gillisley for Bills first down. The next spots, the Redskins will be able to check with a victory today. First back-to-back -back victories. They were the last NFL team to win a road game this season last week in Chicago. And they'll finish up with two divisional road matchups at Philadelphia Saturday night. And in Dallas, week 17, this is Watkins. Third down and one. The handoff to Gillisley, and he will pick up a first down and more. Will take it all the way 60 yards for a Buffalo touchdown. And you've got everything washed down to the inside. Longest career run for Gillisley and the longest run of the season for the Bills. For the Bills, first touchdown today. Carpenter adds the extra point. It's an 18 point game here in Landover, Maryland. Second touchdown of the season for Mike Gillisley. Cousins on third down, under pressure. And he was forced to throw that one away. So now the Bills will get the ball back, a chance to make it a two-score game. The Bills will start from their 15-yard line. They scored a touchdown on their last possession. Off the play fake to Carlos Williams. Catch is made by Nick O'Leary. O'Leary's still going. That's his first NFL reception. That's yeah, some speed. And now Taylor firing downfield for Sammy Watkins. He makes the catch for a Bills touchdown. 48 yards. And how about the throw by Tyrod Taylor? Drops it in right over the top. So the Bills showing some life. Carpenter with the extra point. They pull to within 11. 85 yards on back-to-back -back plays. Redskins start from their 20. 
And now Cousins going deep for Deshaun Jackson. Just out of his reach with Darby defending. Cousins on second and ten. Passes caught. And taken close to a first down by Jamison Crowder. And it's Morris who picks up the first down. Off the fake to Jones. Cousins under pressure. Down he goes as Jerry Hughes had the better of Trent Williams on that play. Loss of 11, second down and 21. Cousins throws. And the catch is made by Reed. Back to the original line of scrimmage. They're down at 16 following the penalty. Redskins must get to the 42. Cousins throws. And the catch is made for a first down on third and 16 by Garçon. And again, there's number 88 at the top. The, the tight formation right there. Pierre Garçon is, is the young son guy. He's going to get, he makes all the, the tough catches. He's a physical guy. He's an emotional guy. This shows you the progress that this off third and 16 when we first started covering the Redskins back in October late October they weren't going to convert as third and 16 yes we have seen our share of the Redskins this season they will take an 11 point lead into the fourth quarter they must get to the Bills 46 Cousins under pressure able to get rid of it and the catch is made by Crowder so the Redskins convert yet again on third down Matt Jones gets just enough of the blitz coming off the edge. You've got a cross formation to get there. So he's got to come across here and try to get this block. And he just gets enough. Catches Duke Williams out of the corner of his eye the last second. From the 37, it's Jones. Jones able to break a couple of tackles. Picks up a first down and then a couple of flags come in. Preston Brown's coming across trying to make a play. He gets up a little bit high. He gets the face mask. Early fourth quarter. Redskins leading 28-17. First and goal from the five to the end zone. Garcon, touchdown! Hopkins, the extra point. Fourth touchdown reception of the season for... Pierre Garçon, Redskins, back up by 18. Third down at 19. Taylor throws, it's Hogan to the Washington 44. So the Bills now facing a fourth down and seven with nine minutes remaining. Three wide receivers set, Watkins split out to the left. Fourth down at seven. Taylor under pressure, he's hit as he throws, and the pass sails incomplete. And now Taylor will be sacked for the fifth time today. Preston Smith with his fourth sack of the season. Final home game for the Redskins as they will hit the road. Face divisional opponents, Philadelphia and Dallas. Catch is made by Woods. D'Angelo Hall, the tackle. Woods knock it out of bounds, so the clock continues to run, and he comes up limping. So for the Bills, they will be eliminated from playoff contention with a loss today. Started the season three and two, five and four, but have dropped three of their last four coming into this one. First season under. Head coach Rex Ryan as Carlos Williams picks up a first down and more out to the 44-yard line. Third down and one. And it's a first down for Booby Dixon. They've come up short here again this afternoon, and, and there will be more questions that he has to ask. But he's one of the guys we enjoy visiting with, enjoy being around and talking football. And uh, you know, I, I, he's going to get this thing figured out. Second and six to the end zone for Watkins. And a Bills touchdown. That's a heck of a throw by Tyrod Taylor. That's a nice touch on that football. Sammy Watkins up at the top. 
Good release off the line to get on top of the defender. Here's Taylor, takes the pitch to Williams. Reaches across and he's in. Ball across the plate. So it's a two-point conversion for Buffalo. And they pulled to within 10 with a minute 26 remaining. To Carlos Williams on the pitch, little fake pitch, gets him outside, cuts up inside. Looks like it's going to be short, but the heady play to break the plane with the football. Now the outside kick, and it's Garcon who fields it for the Redskins. And now they will be able to run out the clock. Bills out of timeouts. So the Redskins will finish with a home record of 6-2, and two, maintain control of the NFC East. They'll move it to sole possession with the Giants' loss, and the Bills in Rex Ryan's first season as their head coach will be eliminated from playoff contention. As Jay Gruden's Redskins win back-to-back -back games for the first time this season, go to seven and seven so the redskins win it by the score of 35 25.